Build a quality email list. Focus on growing a targeted and engaged email list by offering valuable content and incentives to sign up. Personalize your emails. Use segmentation and personalization techniques to tailor your emails to the individual recipient's interests, demographics, and preferences. Craft compelling subject lines. Create attention-grabbing subject lines that entice recipients to open your emails. Avoid using all caps, excessive punctuation, and spammy language. Create visually appealing designs. Utilize professional email templates, images, and graphics. To make your emails visually appealing and engaging, keep it concise and scannable. Keep your emails short and to the point. Use bullet points, subheadings, and clear formatting to make it easy for readers to skim through your content. Use a clear call to action. Clearly state what you want recipients to do after reading your email. Whether it's to visit your website, make a purchase, or sign up for an event. Use a prominent and visually appealing call to action button. Test and optimize. Experiment with the or be testing to optimize your email campaigns. Test different subject lines, designs, call to action buttons, and content to see what resonates best with your audience. Mobile optimization. Ensure that your emails are mobile friendly and responsive, as a significant portion of email opens happen on mobile devices. Segment and automate. Utilize email automation tools to segment your audience based on their behaviors and preferences. Send targeted, personalized emails based on specific triggers or actions. Analyze and track results. Monitor the performance of your email campaigns using analytics tools. Track open rates, click-through rates, conversions, and other metrics to measure the effectiveness of your efforts and make data-driven improvements. Remember that building trust, delivering value, and respecting your subscribers' privacy are essential for successful email marketing. Need professionally written internet marketing follow-up emails? Click on the link below this video 